Thousands of people are expected to pack Chapel Hill this weekend ahead of Halloween. CBS 17's Lillian Donahue is getting answers from businesses and law enforcement who are gearing up for the celebrations. It's going to be a packed weekend. Blues on Franklin is busy preparing for Halloween weekend in Chapel Hill. We cook a lot. Like I smoked uh, 14 shoulders and fork last night, um, about uh, 18 trays of ribs, and so we're getting ready for a lot of hungry people. Historically, the holiday has brought tens of thousands of people to the town. But COVID and wet weather dampened the party in recent years. Crowds and crowds. crowds. It's slowed down a lot, but it's still going to be, it's still kind of the mecca for Chapel Hill. <laughs> Chapel Hill police wants partygoers to keep safety top of mind. Make sure that um, you know what's in your drink, that you have a, a designated driver, and that, that you walk in pairs. Also for safety, police will be shutting down Franklin Street from 8 to 9.30 on Halloween. Parking will be limited, but they will be increasing the light here on this main stretch. We will be visible on Franklin Street. We we have officers that are assigned to our central business district and again we have some increased staffing over the weekend. Folks on Franklin Street are also looking forward to the weekend's big boost in business. Tar Heel born, Tar Heel bred, <laughs> going to be a Tar Heel dead. So this is when all the ghouls and monsters are going to come out. We have a lot of fun on this weekend. Tuesday night's street closure will prohibit outside alcohol, weapons, and anything that could look like a weapon. Reporting in Chapel Hill, Lillian Donahue, CBS 17 News.